Good afternoon. More than 1.6 million New Mexicans are now eligible to get COVID vaccine, and the major hospitals are working to expand their operations to give out more shots. News 13's Chris McKee asked the state's medical leaders about it today. Chris? Each of the New Mexico hospitals are preparing to vaccinate thousands of people a day, each with a different plan. Loveless, for example, they're partnering with the city of Albuquerque. With the city in conjunction, some mass vaccination clinics at some of the high schools being able to set up those clinics using the Department of Health website so that they would set up their appointments and bring those patients through. Now, high schools and community centers across Albuquerque are soon expected to be known as pods or points of dispensation for vaccines. You see in that map there. But any timeline on when is really tied to the unknown of when more vaccine supply hits New Mexico. This week, more than 98,000 doses of Pfizer and Moderna's vaccine are expected in the state. UNMH, meanwhile, is continuing its vaccination clinic at the pit. They've now given out more than 56,000 total doses there. Meanwhile, Presbyterian's newer vaccine clinic at their offices near Balloon Fiesta Park is now doling out about 2,000 shots per day. Now, in Santa Fe, Christus St. Vincent is working on contacting people in three Santa Fe County zip codes with higher poverty rates and more health risks in the population there, all to schedule out vaccine appointments. We're hoping in the very near future, with an abundant supply of vaccine, that we can work with our city, county officials, as well as the National Guard to have large drive through uh, vaccine clinics in the very near future. And no set date, but Krista says it is eyeing to have that happen hopefully in the next few weeks. Well, roughly 1.62 million people are eligible of the 1.68 million New Mexicans who are old enough to get the vaccine. The state says medical providers are still prioritizing those invitations to those 60 and over. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Chris. Presbyterian's chief medical officers advised today that even New Mexicans who have been vaccinated should keep practicing social distancing.